is Premier League player of the month time. Big Dom Solanke in the building. This man is on fire right now in the real world. Bagging goals for fun. Linked to a lot of big clubs. Potentially Arsenal. Doubt it's going to happen. But I rate him in the real world. And EA have given him an 88 rated player of the month card. For cheap and fast FC24 Ultimate Team Coins, head over to MMOEXP.com. Link down below. And make sure to use my code Morsi at checkout to get yourself 5% off. Now a few people are complaining because Sun didn't win this. Son had an unreal goal, goal and assist, I believe, in the month. I think it was like four goals, four assists or something like that. Maybe even more. But Dom Solanke bagged, I believe, six goals. So I think rightfully it should be his to win. But in regards to FIFA meta, Son probably would have been a little bit better. But let's be real. Son has about 15 different promo cards right now. Dom Solanke is a few team in the weeks and that is it. Only three star, four star. This has got the weak foot. Lack of skills, that's fine. 6'2 high medium's got the height. Of course, plays a ball within the Premier League. Shooter looks really solid. 92 finishing position in shot power. Pace spit doesn't look bad. It's reminded me of like um, a lengthy overpowered card at the start of last year. The pace spit being very low in the acceleration, super high sprint speed. Agility and balance being a little bit low, but 99 stamina, 92 strength. Now, one thing he does have in his locker are headers. The man scores headers for days. 99 heading accuracy, can leap like a salmon with 95 jumping. Uh, and with the play styles, of course, power header plus and aerial. It had to be the way. We've also got acrobatic flair and power shot on the card. I'm not going to lie to you. He looks decent. Not super meta, but for the price, 186 team, I can't really complain. Let's see which chem style to give him, and then I'm going to get straight into the gameplay. All right, foot champs, qualities we go. The chem style we settled on was engine. It makes him controlled length feet. It boosts the acceleration as well as the agility and balance. And that is a stacked team for game number one. Jeez, Sessage on 91 as well. I might actually end up mixing up the chem style as well. Give him a go on engine and then maybe drop down to like a hunter potentially. Super juice that acceleration as well as maxing out the shooting stats. But game number one then, we got a game on our hands. Big rely on Sessage on 91 rated. That's a big Evo. Ball roll from Williams. Give me movement, Dom. That's it. You're in behind, lad. He's making it as well. Composure around the keeper. Let's go. He actually felt really composed on the ball there. Hold LB for a little bit. Keeper commits. And we poke it into the open net. That is the dream start. Right, we just say switched on in a defensive aspect here. Because my man's going to be battering the net. And I think he might have one back already. With a Thunderstruck that glitch. Great. So one thing we do need to really test out in this gameplay is the aerial ability of Big Dom Solanke. My man has an absolute cannon of a header on him in the real world. So I'm hoping EA, looking at the stats, they tried to uh, to kind of uh, follow suit with that on this card. But let's see how he performs. If he lives up to it in the actual game itself, as my man step over is uh, out for my throw in. Cheers, bro. Great tackle. Quick, let's go. Big Dom, hold up play. Left stick definitely feels a little bit slow, a little bit sluggish. But you expect that looking at the card stats. Potential to get in behind. DVD's getting blitzed for pace. Hold up, Dominic. He's almost too quick for his own good there. What was that? I knew that was going to happen as well. I don't know why I've actually followed suit with it. I was kind of thinking that my man I might be able to make the ball, but <laughs> we've absolutely clobbered him. Uh, I reckon he's going. You know, people who like take their time go down the middle all day. This man doesn't though. He goes bottom bins. Okay, Dominic can move a little bit, you know. That controlled sprint felt really, really good. Glued to his feet almost. I think the body type of game makes him feel super quick and cracked. You kind of see how he weaves in and out of VVD. And I believe that's what Team of the Week upgrade Varane at the back there. Tough little centre-back duo to play against. Dom makes it look like they're not even there. And he gets his brace already. On the edge, Dom. Doesn't even feel that bad on the ball. There's something weird going on here. I feel like the engine boost makes it feel a lot better than I expected. I thought I was going to get a bit more of a clunkier striker. But left stick alone, he can move. And then that finish as well, one of the strong points for sure. Even without a chem boost to it. Hat trick in 36 minutes, by the way. No, not again. Oh my days. Am I trying to make this man back in the game or something? Like, what am I doing, bro? Why am I tackling it? All right, he went bottom left last time. I can. He, I'm going to stay middle again here. I'm going to stay middle again. Hopefully it happens. He goes top right. Damn it. Mid. 
Mate, Dom Solanke deserved the goal. I put too much power on it and actually smashed the bar instead. This man's dribbling, though, is very, very good. So, Footbin has the price at 74,000 right now, which I think is honestly not that bad for an 88 rated Dominic Solanke special card, especially when he moves this good in game. Like Hullet Eusebio, all the cracked cards on my opponent's team are having issues keeping up with this boy. Oh, Batcher leaps. Forlan. One more Solanke into space. Unbelievable attempt. I feel confident driving at my opponent with this player, by the way. Uh, unfortunately, we don't find the back of the net there, but still a def uh, decent effort. Whip this one in. Big Dom's in there. Big Dom's in there. He does win it. Flicks it towards goal, but Schmeichel cleans up. Mate, what is this card? <laughs> Why is Dom Solanke actually unbelievable? Four goals. Power shot there. Look at the power in this. It moved so much. Michael didn't know what day it was. Oh, it's a great whip. Dom wins the header. But Shemichael again with a save. We're getting closer to getting that uh, the aerial threat goal here. Big interception from the boy. Fortunately, the pass. Not where I wanted it to go. Oh, that's going to be a goal, isn't it? Four all. Well, Dom Forlan. Fizzle it. Christopher. Touch with Dom's good. Strength for power now. All the way, lads. Oh, last second interception from Carl Walker. Dom takes it in his stride. Turns nicely. Pace and power is there. Dominic Solanke is on another level. The man's got five. You could take a touch, turn, beat a player like Carl Walker. Do him for pace and then bag the finish. <laughs> okay. Little dink. Dominic on the volley. He got some power behind that. But Shemichael once again with the save. We could have had a double hatty in this game easily. Maybe we could sneak that one from this corner right here right now. Float it in. Dom leaps. We get the green time header again. But Shemichael makes another stop, bro. This man is the danger in the air, though. That is for sure. Batcher. Float it back stick. Dominic Solanke's in there. Cannot pick him out, though. So the big man from Bournemouth, Dominic Solanke. 88 rated player of the month for 74,000. Is a good deal. This man can move. He's like what I wish Haaland was like in game. Haaland's a bit taller, yes. But this man is so good on the ball. That I'll be dribbling. Like, he just glides. Even the left stick. You're able to recede the ball back towards the goal. Spin. Take on a player. And go. The man is good on the ball enough to beat players like VVD, Carl Walker, Varane. And the finishing once you get in the box. Lethal. We had a few chances with the head as well. Came close, Schmeichel made some good saves, definitely utilised the aerial threat that this man has. Get those whip crosses in, he will score headers for you. I think if you've got a Premier League team and you need a striker, definitely consider this boy. Even though Team of the Year is a week away, he's still usable at this stage of the game. But for the price, I think it's a fun one. Playstyles are nice as well, that power shot we scored moved so much, he like knuckleboarded it past Schmeichel. Flair could come in handy, Acrobatic just adds to that aerial kind of prowess that he has. Very, very good card and genuinely surprised me. I wasn't expecting this man to feel this good in game and to deliver what he's just delivered against that kind of team. Dom Solanke could be underrated here. Let me know your opinion down below. Yes, it's not super meta. It's not a crazy name, but I think it's a fun one here. But yeah, let me know what you think down below. I'll be more to subscribe if you're new. Catch you later.